we're getting started again and you're kind of pixelated so but we're just going with this dad so um what's up okay well we haven't did a napoleon's idiot in a while so well at least three weeks that's because of you so i just wanted to point out that to everybody that's her fault but anyway <laughs> uh, what what we're going to do Threw today the is bus. she called me up and she says to me she says dad I know something that you don't know, and I need to do this for the people. So I said to her, I said, what do you mean? You think I'm an idiot? And she said, I refuse to answer that on grounds of incrimination. So she pleaded the fifth. So what we're going to do today is uh, something that I never thought about, and I basically have the personality is I never cared. I mean, I just, whenever I didn't want to be liked by anybody, I just took them off. But there's more to it than that, and my daughter is more sensitive. So she's going to go through this, and I'm going to listen just like you do. But, you know, if she doesn't do it right, I'm just not going to like her, too. So here we go. <laughs> oh, she my gosh. It. Okay, so go, here's, the, here's the situation. Um, many of you out there may not know this, but uh, we do have a course, a Facebook course, over at Social Media for Beginners. And we have taken that course and those video tutorials into assisted living homes that I am doing the hands-on training for. And one of the biggest questions and concerns that we ran into a couple weeks ago was that they are starting to get friend request. And when they get a friend request, either they don't know the person or they don't want to be friends with them. But they are sensitive also, dad, and they don't want to hurt their feelings. So they didn't know what happens if they were to delete the request and say, no, I don't want to be friends with you. Are these people notified? And so with that, that's what I want to show you is I have unfriended dad, Napoleon's idiot. I unfriended him. I said, nope. Let's see if your feelings get hurt, but it didn't. Anyway, so now what I'm gonna do is I'm going to show you my screen. I'm going to friend request him. He's gonna reject me and say delete request. And then we're gonna see what happens after somebody deletes the request and does not approve your friendship. So that's what we're gonna do. Let me go ahead and dad, I'm gonna bring you down a little bit smaller. And I am now on Facebook. So dad, they can't see you, but they see my screen. And what I'm doing is I am going over to your profile and I'm gonna click on your profile and it comes up. And now it says, add friend. This tells me we are not friends. So I'm going to say, add friend. Now it's telling me that the friend request has been sent. Now dad, on your end, can you go to Facebook and find that friend request. Yes, it says it, it has two people. Okay. <laughs> and I click on it and it says Audrey Ross a stork and it says stork. friend setting. It's all it says. It's oh it, it gives all it also gives me 25 mutual friends that that we have that we share together as friends and uh, it lists every one of them. Okay. Can and I then I have can I say something what? real quick about the mutual friends? Cause that is something Facebook wants you to connect. And so what they do is how they figured out the 25 mutual friends. They put that there so that you can feel, Oh, well we're friends with this person and that friends. I must know this person. So Facebook wants you to connect with this person. And those mutual friends are all the people that are friends with me or friends with dad and friends with me. Okay, so go on. Okay, so then I have a I have an option here. I have confirm or delete request. Okay, I want you to delete. I, now hold on a minute. Okay. Let me talk. What I do, I, I joked around before. It is a hard thing to do because you think you're saying I don't want to be your friend. You got to remember this is social media. You could have hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of friends that fill up your Facebook every day and it will become aggravating. Yes. So what I do is I mostly stay with my family. Mm -hmm. And if I am confronted with somebody that says, I sent you a request, but you didn't take it. 
I have a plausible excuse, which means I will tell them, you know, I'm very busy and I don't have, and I, I like you, you are my friend, but I just decided whenever I'm doing social media, I only will do it with my family and they'll understand. Or you could also say, you know, you're ugly and I just don't want to be a friend with you. So I think the first one was better. So I'm going to delete requests. I'm going to delete requests. Okay. Here we go. All right. Boom. I deleted it. Okay. Now it says mark as spam. <gasps> okay. Now this is something that if you feel that this person has spammed you or that this and spam, what is spam? It's not the stuff. It, it, it's, a, it's a meat that they invented no. in World War II. No, it's, it, it's not that meat. Spam is unwanted, unsolicited crap that comes up in your email, that comes up in Facebook, and that it's somebody that you feel may be trying to spam you to try to get access to you or your account and stuff. Now, please don't mark me as spam because if Facebook will come in and probably shut me down, but I don't know, but. And here's what it says. If you click mark as spam, this person will not be able to send you any more friend requests. Okay, so. With that being said, that means if you click on spam and then let's say a couple months later that you realize, whoa, that was Johnny from elementary school that was trying to friend, you know, send me a friend request, he won't be able to send you another one. But if it is somebody that's bothering you, I guess click that spam button. What do you say, Dad? What I says say, Napoleon's I, idiot? I, I say if not to use it unless you do get multiple requests from that person and you don't want nothing to do with them, then I would go ahead and mark it and you'll not get any more. Okay. So which, which then goes into, I want to show them what happens. I'm going to go back to my Facebook account. So dad, they can't see you again. So I'm going to go back and let's say that, Hey, I remember I sent a, I sent a friend request to my dad. Let's see what's going on. Uh oh, guess what? You deleted that request and now there's nothing here. I can't send you another friend request. So out of curiosity, are you able to click on your home button and like get off of my, you know, I don't know if you're on my account, but are you able to go to my profile and, and do you have an ad friend? on my uh, profile well, okay go. i got it i got it so now what are you asking me i'm asking you do you now that you're you've already deleted the request my friend request so are you able okay. to come back to my profile later on and say well wait a minute i remember who this person was and send me a friend request okay where do i find it um it oh here be add, right on my add cover. a friend okay, okay add a friend yeah, I sent you a friend request. Okay, so now let me head back to Facebook and I've got the friend request and you can always see it with a red square with the number one in it. And then I can confirm or delete the request. So I'm, I don't want to do it because I want to be friends with you, but I'm wondering if I delete the request when you come back to my profile, is my ad friend button gone? So I, I'm not going to do that. <laughs> I don't you see what I'm doing? See, you see what the problem is dealing with her? She goes on and on and on. Can you do this? Can you? And she wonders why I'm an idiot. I'm not an idiot. I just don't understand her. <gasps> no, they understand. What they understand me, me. Nothing. You don't do anything, Dad. I'm going to confirm your friend request, even though you deleted mine. And now I'm going back to Skype. Quit picking your nose. You're back on the on the camera. <laughs> and that's it. We did it. So we have determined. Okay, it says Audrey accepted your friend request. Yes. Right so, on Audrey's timeline. So if I click that, it takes me to your timeline. Right. And I would write something like, uh, yeah. Yeah, don't do it. No, no, no. Okay, okay, so what we have determined is when you send a friend request and that person deletes your request or you get a friend request, you don't want to be friends with them right now or never, whatever. You can delete the request, 
You are not friends with them. They are not notified. I did not get any notification that he deleted my request. However, when I went back to his profile, that add friend button, gone. So, um, I guess you could tell then. Ooh, that could stir up a little bit of something when people go to their... Yeah, I, I, I think what we got to add right here is, uh, yes, when you do all this, it doesn't send them a message saying, hey, Ray doesn't like you and he wouldn't accept it. If I was you, I would do away with him. Right. It doesn't do that. But yet, yeah. I would know in a short amount of time yeah. that you did not accept my thing. That's why you need to have that plausible deniability. And you can always come up with, I only do the family, or I have so many on there, I just don't have time. Uh, you know, I love you, send me money, whatever you want to say to them. But yes, they still they still know it. But the only way that you can handle it is to have <clears throat> requirements for your Facebook on who you want to be friends with. And they should use another term other than friends because it does leave you with this feeling that, gosh, I don't want to do that to them. I, I mean, I'm not, don't like them really, but you know, but even with regular friends without the computer and all, you only have one or two really true friends. Right. Yeah. And those are the ones that don't call you an idiot and put you out on the internet. <laughs> Hey, okay, you've been I, missing it. You have been missing I, it. But anyway, just so everybody knows, though, that this same exact uh, Facebook course, along with the YouTube, I got the YouTube done. And today I, I should be getting Twitter done and the Skype and everything. All of these uh, courses, along with the video tutorials and everything, are offered on the social media for beginners.com. And we are getting a lot of good responses and feedback and they are learning how to use facebook and connect with their family and friends so remember remember you can help us by either sending money and we don't give you anything for it or buying one of the products and we give you something for it or just tell your friends to log on and follow us because we will keep you laughing right up to the time they put you in a in a casket well, and that's from the that's from the armed forces retirement home. <laughs> All right. So if you like our, if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. If it helped you out, actually share it because it's it answered a very uh, um, widely asked question. And be sure to subscribe. And we will definitely be back on track doing weekly Napoleon's Idiot series episodes. Okay. All right. Bye, Dad. Thank you. Bye. Bye. Love you. Love yes. you. Love you. Love you. Love Bye. you too. Yes. Okay. Love, yeah. All right. Bye.